Hey guys, Spin the Demon here. Uh, just going to do a video for you guys about um, little handhelds with built in games. I got a couple different kinds, some by Tech Toy, uh, PlayPal, all kinds of different ones. So I'm going to show you, try to capture a little bit of the gameplay. Alright, let's start with the VG Pocket. Uh, this is the tablet model. And it has uh, 25 built in games. Got it at GameStop, $9.99. Uh, usually has like the VG ones, usually have like one licensed game and the rest are kind of clones. I'll show you some gameplay in a minute here. This one's the Frogger 25th anniversary, so it has uh, Konami licensed Frogger and a couple other games. Pretty fun. They're black. They're backlit. Not like the, you know, best quality, but they're pretty cool. You can get it like this and then you can get it like the tablet or not the tablet the capsule model and I think this one has uh, 50 games I'll check and it, it's a I think um, another licensed one Taito licensed has Space Invaders I don't have the box and I'll just turn this one on and show you real quick zoom in here. Fifty games, Space Invaders. It's uh, Space Invaders, Bust a Move, and Burger Time are those are the official licensed ones. And then you get into the clones. And then here's the At Games, and this one has Sega Genesis games on it. It's pretty cool, and you can't add more games. You can hook these all up to the TV. So they're pretty cool to have around. Just to keep in your pocket or whatever. Have your little portable Genesis. And, you know, I think it's uh, 20 games on this one. But they're all there, full length. So, and here's the next one I have is the Black Play Pal. This one's Master System and Game Gear games. Also hooks to the TV. Probably go more into detail when I do individual reviews. I just want to show you some of these handhelds. And yeah. This thing uh, really got me into Master System games to the point where I got a Master System and now I'm collecting them. Had one before and I lost it, but I, I got right back into it because of uh, this handheld. I played a lot of Fantasy Zone and such like that. It's my Alex kid. So that's that. That's pretty bad. And then we have the Mugga, which is just like the PlayPal. I don't know if there's fresh batteries in this one or not. Yeah, it looks like it might be dead. But uh, the cool thing about this one, it takes SD cards. Right here, the SD slot. And you can listen to your music while you're playing games, and it's an MP3 player as well. That's pretty cool. Uh, you got your battery door there. And you can put a DC 4.5 volt in there. Has AV out. Headphone jack. USB. This is pretty cool. Jam out to your music, and you can uh, mix it in. So if you're playing like you know the Gen or the Game Gear games or the Master System games, you can be listening to your custom music. So that's pretty cool. And this isn't my handheld, for like my entire handheld collection. This is just the handheld collection that has those like built-in, I don't know if you want to call them emulators or whatever they are, the built-in games for there in the VG Pocket. So if you want me to do any type of full review on any of these individually, let me know. Um, 
the only one I didn't turn on is this one and uh, yeah so I'll probably be doing a full review on this one show you guys this one's really neat and I like this one a lot so this will probably be the next one I wish I had like two more hands and I would do some more gameplay for you but it's uh, kinda hard to film and play at the same time so alright guys 